Story recap. With the help of the Dragon Balls, Krillin and the others... Well, what did that say? Felled? Looks like the Dragon Balls have been restored. You can hunt them down with the Dragon Radar. Interesting. Was this the training? What the heck? Didn't I get these? With Vegeta? Oh, Super Special Beam Cannon. How do I get that? Learn Special Beam Beam Cannon level 3. <clears throat> Alright, let's go ahead and... Uh, what level am I at? I'm level 33. Okay, I should be able to do it. This would be a good warm-up anyways to the game, I think. Holy cow. Prepare yourself. Oh gosh, I'm very rusty. Yeah, I need to charge up anyways. Come on, Raditz! And of course they move. Whoa! Prepare yourself! Wait, how do I... Oh, that's it? No, my health! Oh my gosh, my health already! Wow. Yeah, this is... <laughs> this is a lot more difficult than I remember. Holy jeez, again? Charge up. Let's see. Go. Oh my gosh, my health is already going to go in the red. My health is already in the red. Jeez. Look at my health. Oh my god. I feel like I'm losing health. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm 
Oh my gosh, there's no way I'm gonna be do gonna be able to do this. Yeah. There's no way. That's it. <laughs> Quit training, that's it. There's absolutely no way. I can't even take one of them down. That's crazy. Recommend the level 35 and I'm level 33. That is insane. Uh, okay, so uh what is this dragon ball location oops let's go ahead and go to it might need a level up vegeta first so i don't know nice Nice. Cool. Uh, let me go ahead and I want to travel to the other map. Oh, look, there's a Dragon Ball everywhere. Well, maybe not everywhere, but there's one on uh, Sacred Land of Corin, West City. Two of them over here on the wasteland, one over here, and one in commies. So let's go ahead and get the Dragon Balls. And it is right here. Nice. Just like that. Oh my god. Um, they look really strong. Whoa, what is that? I don't think I can fight it. Oh, destroy. Just like that. Oh wow. The metal, nice. Yeah. Destroy. I got it. Yeah. Green. That looked more like red. Yeah. Is it me or is Dragon Ball Z awkwardly quiet right now? Usually, there's music playing in the background. Wait, what is this? Is this training? Yeah, it is. <clears throat> okay, so now that I got that one, I can go to get the next one in West City. Where's Boma's house? Uh, let's see. Where's the Dragon Ball? Do I have to travel outside of the city? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it's all the way out here in the middle of the ocean. Four star ball. Okay, let's see. World map. We'll go to, we'll go here.
Oh gosh, I need to do something really quick. Go and check it out. Oh, the, oh yeah, right. There's two balls over here. There we go. Uh, first one's over there. Looks like it's on top of the mountain, maybe. Oh gosh, I guess I'll fight him. A new code that I require assistance with. What? <laughs> um. Honestly, <laughs> maybe I'll. Maybe I can help you later. But other people can help you out in chat if they would like to. Is it like a common cipher code that you use to decipher it? So technically, once you figure out the cipher, you can figure out all of them, right? Or is it does it change every time? Why is it telling me to go to world map? I you don't know, but you're the leader of the of the country. Or the the nation, the micro nation that you, or uh, that you, uh, you know, take care of. I might. It's uh, It's uh, This is opposing enemy codes. What the heck? <laughs> So that's an enemy code that you need to decipher. What the? That is insane. How did you get it? Like, did it, did it just appear in the mail? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But that's wild. Right over there, nice. I think I can handle this. Wow, a waterfall. Oh, a cave. Nice, just need one more Dragon Ball pretty much and that's it. What is this? Oh, just re regular ore, I think. There we go. Nice. We found it in the in the radio. And ten a slip of paper in the armor of the fallen enemy. You make it seem so casual. <laughs> like, I don't know how to feel about... I don't know. Ooh, what's in here? You look really strong. I'm gonna take you down! Oh 
Oh my gosh. Yo, did the game get harder or something? I don't remember it being this difficult. Oh, really? Missiles? What the heck? No. How's that? What's down here? What is all this stuff? There's a lot of power in this. Wow, this energy is incredible. There's a lot of power in this. Something I can pick up? D metal? Yeah. This is pretty cool. Um, you look really strong. I'm out. Oh yeah, isn't there another Dragon Ball? Or was that the last one? No, there's still one more. It's on. It's actually on a Kami's uh, island, I think. Yeah. And it is over here in the middle of the water. How's that sound? This is taking a while to fall to. <laughs> nice. Um, you look really strong. Uh, I think so, I can handle this. There's a sub story there. The mystery of the missing tail. Question is, where do I summon the the dragon at? I'll probably do this side mission really quick though. There we go. Uh, I think I can handle this. Oh my gosh, there's so many enemies. Here I go. I'm trying to aim for the small one, but it's not letting me. Like him. Nice. Not bad. Hey, what is it up? Everyone was kung fu fighting. <laughs> what kind of comments are those? <laughs> Bruh. All right, let's go ahead and go down here. Oh, there's Oolong. 
Ooh, anything in here? No, there's not. Oh, go on. What brings you here? <laughs> Nothing in particular. <laughs> That's so. Well, make yourself at home. Stop. Say, if you have a minute, I was hoping we could chat. Vegeta cannot be in your party. <laughs> that is funny. Dang, you beat me too. I wanted the satisfaction. <laughs> My bad. Stop! Now that you mention it, I haven't seen it in a while. <laughs> Maybe it's gone for good. Yeah, I think that was the last time he grew it back. Kami clipped it. What? Oh, that is true. Why did he do that? Huh? You serious, kid? He doesn't know? No one filled him in about Saiyans going ape. Should I really be the one to break it to him? Nice. <laughs> oh, what am I saying? The the planet would be in serious trouble if uh, if Dad suddenly turned into a great ape. So he does know. <laughs> you got it. So you knew after all. Well, I guess you would, having fought the Saiyans. Anywho, Kami got rid of your old man's tail to suppress his inner simian. Is that what I said? Do you think Kami got... Uh, can't say. Why don't you ask him? You know what? I think I will. <laughs> yeah. I'm dying to know myself. Yeah, that's the pig. He can also shapeshift. Just like four, that little floating cat rabbit thing. So I gotta go to Kami's tower or lookout, I should say. They are fighting at the temple. <laughs> I don't, I don't know, uh, Kron. There's a lot of power in this. That whole, that whole deciphering thing. Uh, wow, this energy's interesting, horrible. but uh. <laughs> That's all I got to say about it. Um. All right. Let's see. Yes. Ah, uh, Gohan. Did you need something? Hi. I heard you removed my dad's tail a while back, which got me wondering, did you do the same to mine? No. <laughs> no, I'm afraid to say I had nothing to do with it. <laughs> oh, but it's not growing back. Why is that, you think? At a certain age, hey. you stop growing the tail. Questions pertaining to Saiyan physiology are perhaps best answered by a Saiyan. <laughs> Come to think of it, Vegeta doesn't have a tail anymore either. And I don't know about going to see him. It's because Yadrobi chopped it off with the samurai sword. Given what Vegeta has done in the past, it would be prudent to exercise caution, though I doubt there's any real need to see him at all. Right. It's just, this is... Wait, what? I'll ask him. Understood. Mm, well, be careful. Wait a minute. He ripped his tail off? Kami ripped Goku's tail off when he was training with Kami. And that was in Dragon Ball. That was before Dragon Ball Z. So this was before... Kami ripped off Goku's tail before Dragon Ball Z, which was the start of this. So I don't know why he's barely finding out about it. The green guy did it right, unless my memory is trash. Oh, the other green guy. Yeah, the other green guy chopped off or ripped off Gohan's tail. And then he grew it back. And then Gohan went great ape again. Um, and then Vegeta chopped it off, I think. And then Gohan fell on Vegeta during that fight. I don't know if you remember. Never mind, I know nothing. <laughs> Same. Hey! Kakarot's brat, huh? <laughs> You've come at a good time. Fight me! What, what the heck? 
And don't hold back unless you rather die. Oh my god. Holy jeez. Don't underestimate me. Oh, dang. Ooh, nice. Another one. No, I knew it. Oh, one more hit. Nice. Dang, 194,000 XP. <laughs> How could the Prince of Saints struggle against a child? <laughs> What now? <laughs> I have a question. <laughs> My tail's not growing back. <laughs> and? Well, yours isn't growing back either, so I was wondering if you knew the reason. Well, I thought we could hang out since we're the no-tail crew. <laughs> I have no interest in becoming a great ape. Attain Super Sainhood is my priority now. <laughs> Super Sainhood? Any hurdle Kakarot can leap, so can I. So he wants to become a Super Saiyan. Wait, that's it. Maybe there's no need for a tail if you're stronger than a great ape. That is true. I should report back to... Report back to Oolong. Hey, Zen, who made the light bulb? Who made the light bulb? Wasn't that uh, Thomas Edison? Or was it uh, Stop. Nikola Tesla? I'm pretty sure it was Thomas Edison. Dude must suck badly losing to a child. Johan spoke at uh, length with Oolong about all that happened and his thoughts on Saiyan Tales. I thought it was Warren De La Rue? Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> huh? You got it! Uh, Thomas Edison drew a pan a patent and applied <sighs> er, and applied for an application what? in 1880. Yeah. But as for the inventor, let me see. In 1878, Thomas Edison began a serious <sighs> research into developing a practical incandescent lamp on the on October 14th, 1878. He filed his first patent application for hey, improvement on electric lights. So if it's before 1878, then on, uh, you should be... <sighs> Let me see. He made it in 1840. So yeah, okay. you must you must be right then. Yeah. Mr. Crown, you're always right. <laughs> Let's just say that. You're always right. There's a lot of people on here that like to be right. So uh, I'll just say it. <laughs> you guys really are right. Loose. All right. Let's go ahead and start the next side mission.
Oh, let's go ahead and talk to Bulma. Get over how huge Bulma's place is. Oh, it's poor, oh. not Bulma. Oh, uh, the curiosity's killing me. Hi there, poor. Oh, Gohan, perfect timing. I've got a small favor to ask you. Oh, yeah, what do you need? <laughs> it's about Yamcha. Since he's been back, he's been really enjoying himself. <laughs> Hey, that's great. <sighs> but you know, I'm really worried about his dating situation. I sure hope things are going well for him. <sighs> I'm sure they are. Yamcha's always been pretty good with that stuff, right? Hmm. Well, yeah, but I'm so worried. Excuse me? Go on, do you think you could go check on him for me? What? Wait, me? Yeah, I would do it, but I've got something I have to do instead. So, can you help me? Sure. One cool dude? That's the mission? <laughs> Hi! Sure, I could do that. Leave it to me. Thanks! Thank you so much. So, where can I find Yamcha? Hmm. I think he's on a date with Sapphire, so he's probably somewhere on the road northeast of town. Got it, I'll head there. Let's check it out. What? Guess I'm gonna have to get wet if I wanna get some seaweed? Did someone really just say that? Northeast? Is that what it said? Northeast? Yeah, it's that way. Oh, wow, that was quick. Another cutscene? <clears throat> there he is. <laughs> Today's such an awesome day. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. <laughs> this is so cringy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He needs to cut his hair so he can catch up with Wait the Android saga. Minute. Oh, another girl! Oh my gosh! Come on! Oh snap! Hey now! Come on! Mr. Kron, you tell me the answer because it seems like you <laughs> you know more about that stuff than I do. So you can probably answer that question. Come on! Oh gosh. There we go. I have a really bad habit of pressing X or square. Which skips over or pauses the uh, captions. Who do you think discovered America? A human? <laughs> well, technically dinosaurs. <laughs> no, I'm, just <laughs> I'm just kidding. Who discovered Pangea? <laughs> Some crazy questions. The world away. <laughs> the world may never know. How many Come licks does it take on. to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Is that what the commercial is? Whoa, they just whooped out with some Pokemon? Well, they're standing like they're so <laughs> stiff. Why are they standing like they're so stiff? <laughs> I know, Yamcha's at least breathing. They're just like NPCs. Oh, no. No. Yeah, look at them. They're so st <laughs> They're not even breathing. They're just standing there. I 
I haven't heard of that Tootsie Pop commercial in years. Nah. <laughs> Dang. Easy. Oh, snap. Oh, my gosh. There's more? Oh my god. I gotta charge up my key. I'm pretty sure dinosaurs lived before Alfred Wagner. <laughs> so I think they discovered Pangea. <laughs> but not during Pangea. <laughs> Are you serious? Yamcha can't get out of- What the heck? He's, he's not even moving. Well, all I have to say, Mr. Krond, is that we all have the internet at the tips of our fingers, basically, so... And... What? Yeah, that's- Oh my gosh, he's in that same position. Wait, no, got confused. I was thinking of Gond's what? Gond Wanna Land. What? I don't know what that is. I'm sorry. I'm not educated enough <laughs> to know where that's located at. <sighs> you know, we should go eat ice cream, the two of us. <laughs> at least they're moving now. The breathing, I should say. I'm fine, poor. <laughs> yeah, I'm just, just laying there. I'm stronger now. <laughs> yeah. I'm a former student of King Kai. That is true. I can't let something like this bring me down. That's my Yamcha. You're still the coolest guy around. <laughs> okay. Yamcha, he, he definitely is stronger than he was before. Okay, okay. Awesome book for grown-ups. <laughs> Uh, what a, a reward that is. It's over. Nice. Mm, any more side stories? Let's see. Oops, wrong button. Wait, what? There's another side story at West City? There we go. Let me see. And uh, there's. I'm not seeing anything. That's weird. <clears throat> you have to go to it again? Do I have to go to Capsule Corp? Oh, there is another city over here. I will say that. I, I don't think I've ever been to this other city.
Let me see. Is there a sub story? There is not. What the heck? Okay, you know what? Uh, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I could go into Capsule Corp. Maybe that's why? Damn, I'm questioning my entire education. <laughs> I mean, it's important to question it. Like, there's so much I don't know. I mean, I admit that I know that I don't know everything. Got it. But I usually don't talk about really anything either. What is Krillin doing here? Hey. <laughs> oh my gosh. Whoa. I got something from him? Hey there! Alright, one more time. Let's see if anything changed. Who was the first to arrive to New Zealand? Most say it is Morris, but I don't know. Uh, I don't know either. You know, I'll, I'll just say this. Uh, Earth? Or humans, I should say. Humans have been around. As far as I know, modern humans, uh, and this number probably has changed. It's, I think modern humans have been around for 100,000 years. Uh, our ancestors, ancestors have probably been around longer than that, maybe a million years, who knows. Uh, but anyways, um, we've only been recording for the past like couple thousand years, I think, right? Maybe six, 6,000 years, or 10... 12,000 years, I think. So anything before that. So 12,000 years ago up to 100,000 years ago, we don't know what happened. That's all I got to say. Sure. And don't quote me because information changes all the time, especially Yo. when you find out new information. Okay. So. Perfect timing. Want to have a little spar mat, what? sparring match? Ooh, that's interesting. Yeah. Yeah, I told you I trained under King Kai after I died in the fight against the Saiyans. Well, I haven't really had an opportunity to show off what I've learned. It's like I went through that brutal training for nothing. I'm a lot stronger now. Honest, I really am. Well, I think Damn. it's, uh... Phoenicians that found New Zealand? Yeah? Wolf me. I get wolf me and tofu. Nice. Yamcha, the man, the myth, the legend. <laughs> sure, I'm willing to help in any way I, I can. Oh, we're at the beach. Cool. Dang, everyone wants to fight Gohan because there's no Goku around. Oh, snap! Messing up Yamcha. Oh, really? Dang, he was that far in the water? That is crazy. Not bad. Almost 104,000. XP. <laughs> I 
Damn! That should be better than this. Dang! Um, Go on, got pretty good training. I had Guru unlock some of my hidden power. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, Yamcha has a mustache? Looks like he has a mustache. Never mind. Excuse me! Oh yeah, it looks like he has a mustache again. <sighs> I'll be honest, this sucks. I can't even believe this is the best I could do. And after all that hard work. <laughs> Don't talk like that, Yamcha. <gasps> Don't you remember? You're the one who saved me when I was being attacked by that pterosaur. You risked your life to protect <laughs> me. You're the coolest, bravest guy I know. You should be more confident in yourself, Yamcha. Right. <laughs> hmm. No reason why I did because I thought poor scream was coming from a <laughs> coming from a dam damsel. <laughs> I don't. I don't know what that is. <laughs> well, I had no idea you did that, Yamcha. Huh? You're really a great, great guy. Is that what I said? I went off to read some Wikipedia and I heard moaning. What's happened? I don't know. There's no moaning. There's talking. And they're making sounds. To uh, kind of imitate them talking. But no moan, no moaning around here. Alright, cool. So that should be it for the sub story. Characters. Um party okay that that gives me an idea I'm gonna go train I'm gonna see if I can add people to my party and if I can't then oh well I, I think I can handle this Wow, it's like Mario. <laughs> Three jumps. Okay, anyways. Right here. Um, okay. Uh, let me go ahead and add two people to the party. Probably be Vegeta and Piccolo. Oh, nice. What's up, guys? Nope, I'm by myself. Maybe it's Nappa that I need to go for first. Oh my gosh, Raditz, come on. Yeah, there's absolutely no way. I heard nothing. The heck is wrong with you? <laughs> Thank you, Muffin. I leave for five minutes and I come back and see the word moaning. Explain. I can't ask Zen. <laughs> I already explained it, and Muffin didn't hear anything, so <laughs> I don't know what's going on. But uh, let's go ahead and we should be able to start the main story. Oh, and of course, there's a another sub story. Loki, I am craving some Pokemon. So I might play some Pokemon today. I'm trying to refrain playing too many games in one stream. Because this is already... Oh, what the heck? Kooky. Kooky Cook? Please save me. These weirdos came out of nowhere. 
Seth, just don't say anything anymore. <laughs> you're making it worse. And you're getting your information from, from Wikipedia? I mean... It is a good source, but it's not the best source. It's good to cross... To cross-check your information. Oh, it's water break time. Oh no. Nice. You're reading about it. Oh. Then it went to the other one since I read it all. You know, it could be a, an ad that you're getting that <laughs> that made that sound that you, that you were saying. It could be an ad that you have. Or maybe it's another tab that you have open. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's pretty messed up. Okay, I'm gonna stop talking. I know, isn't it just the worst? Well, I think hmm? they were... Oh, it's, it's going by too fast, I can't read it. Well, guess I'll get started. Well, I better get going now. Zip! <laughs> hey, now! <laughs> what? Well, that's what Mr. Kron is saying. He's he's doing a lot of research right now. He's on Wikipedia asking me questions that I don't know the answer to. Or at least I thought I did. Yeah. So he has a lot he probably has a lot of tabs open. And like I said, it could be an ad that he has up. Goodbye. Uh I don't know what type of ad. Hi. But that is why. That is another reason why. Ads are horrible, man. Any ad. Especially if it's representing an anime mobile game. No, I am okay. Any anime mobile game is a no-go. They exaggerate anything and everything. No mobile anime games. I've heard good things about Genshin Impact, but anything other than that, uh, no thank you. Nothing against them, it's just I've had personal bad experiences with them. <laughs> and then as soon as I experience it, I just oop, uninstall. Simple as that. Don't want nothing to do with that. Alright, well, it looks like I did all the sub stories, so now. Whoa! Oh, I got it! It's a timer! Dude, just fly, fly fast. Wow, that's it. Is incredible. There we go. Um, let me go ahead and organize everything really quick. No mobile games bad. <laughs> uh oh wait, what's that? What are these? Dragon Balls. First wish. I want to fight Raditz again, Nappa again, Dodoria again, Zarbon again, Ginyu Force again. I want Z orbs, I want to be rich. I want rare items. Uh, I'll probably hold off on my dragon. On, on <laughs> I was going to say my dragon balls, but I don't have dragon balls. So on the dragon balls. Uh, let's see. Uh, no, no, no. Community, community. Let's see, I should have more characters. Ooh, oolong. His best one is uh, that one. I don't know what it would be. What is he? Uh, adult. Do I have poor? 
I do. But what's their biggest strength right now? It'd be food. So I can move poor. Whoa, he's Super Saiyan. Wow. Goku must be training off planet as a Super Saiyan. Okay, anyways, uh, let's see. What can he level up in? He can level up in uh, training and adventuring. I feel like training and... I don't have any training ones. Chi Chi, she's already level... Maxed out on cooking. Launch? What level is launch and cooking? Level 11. <clears throat> all proficiencies. Who needs all proficiencies? Vegeta? Uh, Gohan? Probably Gohan. Piccolo? Definitely. Nice. So, Adult, Adventure, and Z Warrior. Adult, and, uh, let's see. And he's re he's already gonna be maxed out. Oolong, I'm gonna go ahead and up upgrade Oolong. And for the adventure part, I'd rather give it to Yajirobe. Yeah. Nice. All right, let's go ahead and start the mission. Ah, uh, mom's always worried about me. I can walk around. Cool. What the heck? Grandpa's in here. AKA King Ox or Ox King. Well then, ready to hit the books again, Gohan? I thought she was going to say ready to hit the gym again. <laughs> Make a day. <laughs> He's going to tell his mom make a dish. Uh, let me add him. Do nothing. Can I make any dishes? Let's see. Meat lovers meat fest. Can I make that? Meat lovers meat fest. Me lovers meat fest. Nope. Don't have anything for that. What about the fish one? Okay, I'll take this. Fresh seafood rice bowl. Rich seafood soup. Dense sesame dumpling. Not gonna lie, all that sounds pretty good right now. Talking about... <laughs> Did you know... <laughs> Okay, Krond. Uh, uh, no comment. <laughs> Muffin, you can decide what you want to do. <laughs> you're, you're the moderator. <laughs> if you want to do something about it, you can. If you don't, uh, I guess that's okay, too. Uh, let's see. Fresh seafood, rich seafood, dense sesame seed. Do I have the stuff to make that? Fresh seafood rice bowl. I still don't have that. Seth, chill. <laughs> uh, wow, I don't have anything to make anything. 
Okay, let's go and just fight. Well then, ready to hit the books again? Gohan? Let me let me at him. You want to continue the story? Your party your party will be disbanded. That's what I like to hear. You should study up and surprise your father with your genius when he gets back. That's what I like to hear. You should study up and surprise your father with your genius. With your genius when he gets back? I feel like I'm saying that wrong. With your genius. Yeah, I don't sure know. thing. Hurry back, Dad. We miss you. He's just on another planet. <laughs> Training. Roughly a year and a half had passed since the fight with the dreadful Frieza. But there was still no sign of Goku returning to Earth. The world had entered a period of peace. That peace, however, was to be short-lived. As a new threat was rapidly approaching the planet. Hey, nice. And then sell. Yep. Nay. Not gonna lie, I'm pretty hype. <clears throat> sell saga is always pretty good. Oh, everyone's here already. Krillin. You felt it too, right? It's Frieza and someone else with enormous power like his. Whoa, look at Gohan's hair. Yeah, kind of hard not to notice. There's no way we're going to miss a massive energy reading like that. This can't be good. Do you really think it's Frieza? Well, sure seems like it. They'll know we're here if you don't quit your foolish babbling and lower your power levels. <laughs> they Vegeta. have scouters after all. The Namekian's already lowered his. At least one of you is smart. <laughs> Piccolo! <laughs> the same voice right actor. <laughs> Vegeta and Piccolo are the same voice actor as well. <laughs> but, uh... Imagine seeing that in real life. That'd be nuts. Over there. It's Frieza. It's gotta be. I can't believe he's still alive. Now, hold on. I think there's someone else with him. Do not fly there, got it? We can avoid scouter detection by simply walking up to them. You, you guys have actually fought against someone with this much power? <laughs> you, you gotta be kidding me! What are we supposed to do once we get close to them? You'd rather stay back here and rot, is that it? Oh my god. Suit yourself. All of us know what we're up against. Just to be perfectly clear. Earth is completely done for. Oh, just like that? This can't be happening. First of all, why the heck is Gohan wearing a Saiyan outfit? I don't remember. Let me look it up. I don't remember Gohan wearing a Saiyan outfit. Whoa, it does show him in uh saying in the same outfit. That is so weird. I don't remember that. You cannot fly or fire key blasts while moving. Is there any uh no, there's absolutely nothing. So I could talk to talk to everyone about Frieza's invasion. <laughs> How in the world did Frieza survive? You actually held your own against someone that powerful? Dang! Not gonna lie, uh, Tian's kind of uh, swole there. He's unbelievable! I came to get a peek at that Frieza guy. I never got a chance while we were on Namek. Oh no! What are we going to do? 
Look at There's just regular traffic in the background. <laughs> no one notices. So, this Frieza guy, he's really that tough, huh? Damn that Kakarot. Why didn't he finish that bastard off? Wait, are they all the same at this point? <laughs> and to think we're going up against him again. It's just crazy how some voice actors can sound completely different if you don't know like anything about the show. Like how many characters one voice actor can play. First so, wheel move. It's interesting. On but. foot, of course. That cat thing, Puar, you're saying Puar is the moaner? Uh, no comment. <laughs> Man, the closer we get, the heavier the air seems to oh, get. Oh, look at Yamcha cut his hair. We're almost at his ship. Are you sure you're ready for this? Yes. And King Cold. Shay. Ooh, they made his metal uh, look pretty good. So this is Earth. What the heck? I've seen worse hunks of rock. It seems this Super Saiyan Goku you keep going on about is set to arrive here in three hours. Yeah, that's Frieza's dad right there. So you intend to wait for him, Frieza? Why, of course, father. But I want him to suffer for what he did to me, so I think I'll slaughter every last one of his beloved Earthlings. What happened to the purple guy? <laughs> he didn't survive. <laughs> I couldn't care less about the Earthlings, but we do absolutely need to rid ourselves of that Super Saiyan. They brought him back as a half cyborg. By any means necessary. And then he joined the Justice League. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> that was a bad joke. Hmm. Oh, there's trunks. And what brings you here, Earthlings? Mysterious man. I'm gonna kill you. Or youth. Dang, just like that. Not the Justice League, lol. <laughs> A mysterious savior <laughs> from the future. What's that now? You're here to kill us, you say? Hmm. Eliminate him. Sir! Dang, all of them. <laughs> Shee! Just like that. That's how fast you could cut a pepperoni well, pizza. Now, it seems you've got some skill. Come at me with everything you've got. Unlike Goku, I won't take it easy on you. Goku? Oh, I see. So you're an ally of his. Never met the guy. Only know him by name. Dang! Just like that. Oh, dear. You do realize that killing my men puts you in grave danger, do you not? Now I have to kill you myself. <laughs> you miscalculated. A miscalculation? Oh, I beg to differ. Wiping you and the rest of the filth from this planet would be child's play. <clears throat> That's not what I meant. You're about to find out what it's like to fight a real Super Saiyan. And I'm not talking about Goku. There's another one right here. Well, the anticlimactic. <laughs> oh, whoa, I'm gonna fight him? Prepare to die! The only one dying here is you. Ooh, I got burning attack. Ooh, that's I'm gonna use that move. You came all the way here to Earth seeking revenge, but unfortunately for you. You're not going to be able to carry it out. This is it! Oh no! I'm going to kill both of you. That's not a threat. I hope they show what he does with... Uh... Oh, whoa! Oh no. Look, I didn't even know this was going to be a fight in this game. I thought it was just going to be a cutscene. That's how it usually is in the other games. No! 
Oh, he broke my shield. That's all it took, huh? This is it! Nice! One more hit. Yeah, buddy. Uh, Mr. Crown, no. Uh, I don't think... Well, I don't know that. I'll, I'll just say that. I don't know that. How is this possible? Frieza! There we go. Just like that. Impossible. Dang. Oh, no. He did not do that. Uh, he did not do that. Actually, he kind of did, but not in that, not that fast. the world is going on <laughs> one way to find out all right now we go over there yep just go on <laughs> because he's the strongest so i guess i could see why they sent gohan oh no it's the whole crew that's him isn't it keep your guard up we don't know who we're up against. Doesn't he have a Capsule Corp jacket? Yeah, it says on the side. Right. I'm going to head over there and wait for Goku. <laughs> You're more than welcome to join me. That's crazy. What? 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 How does he know about my dad? Vegeta's low-key jealous. He's going to show up right over there. If you're coming, then follow me. So what do we do? <laughs> uh, I'm... I'm gonna follow him. Yeah, me too. I'm going to find out who this creep is. This creep? <laughs> and how does he know Kakarot? <laughs> does it not show his ship? Or his time machine, I should say. He doesn't seem like a bad guy. Whoa, did you see that giant dinosaur? Oh my gosh, Godzilla. Um, so how do you know my dad? Well, I've only heard about him. I haven't had the privilege of actually meeting him yet. Oh, uh, really? So, hey, how do you know when Goku's coming back? Well, um... I'm afraid I can't tell you that. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, can I ask, you were a Super Saiyan when you beat Frieza earlier, weren't you? H how did you do that? Unfortunately, I can't <laughs> tell you that either. Sorry. What's your name? I can't uh, tell you that either. That too. <laughs> you can't even tell us your name? Well, what about your age? I'm 17. Okay. So you can tell us your age. <laughs> but that's all I can tell you. I really am sorry. <laughs> Same. Uh, well, I guess it doesn't matter. You saved the Earth after all. It'll be another three hours before Goku gets here. So please, just hang right. tight a little bit longer. Well, at least they're touching grass. Hey, uh, Muffin, does this count? Does the game count as me touching grass? Because they're all touching grass right now. He should <laughs> be here soon. Or is that not how it works? Oh, dang! In the space, uh, in a Saiyan pod? I didn't know that. Most important question. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, I was gonna say, huh? it better show his yard rat uniform. Coco! And the answer is no. How'd you guys know I was gonna be here? <laughs> this young man here clued us in. Who is he? <laughs> you mean you don't know who this is at all? Nope, never seen him before. That reminds me. Who took care of Frieza and the others? 
That was some crazy energy. We've got him to thank for that as well. He made quick work of them by becoming a Super Saiyan. A Super Saiyan? <laughs> Goku, I need to speak with you. Goku. In private, if you don't mind. With me? Uh, yeah, sure. Hey, what's the big deal? You gonna keep us in the dark? Sorry, guys. Just hang tight for a bit, okay? And Piccolo's gonna hear. He he can he says in a movie. Oh, I'm Goku again. He says in a movie. I guess I'd better go talk to him. To be more specific, Piccolo said in a BoJack Unbound movie that he can literally hear everything in the universe. And I guess that's what Namekians can do. I mean, uh, dang, Piccolo's tall compared to Goku. That's crazy. But yeah, fun fact. Well, is it a fact? I'm pretty sure uh, they said he could turn into a Super Saiyan as well. I did want to look at something, though. Uh, I'll just make this into Super Kamehameha. Body blow. I feel like I should put... Impact Strike 29. Insert Cough of Death. Don't worry, Piccolo. Trunks is gonna help you this time. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Just who is that guy? I need to know something. Are you able to become a Super Saiyan at will? Yeah. I mean, I couldn't at first. But I can control it pretty good now. That's great. Now I have to ask, would you mind transforming for me now? Why is he asking for it. proof? <laughs> this good? So, what now? now? Now we fight. I'll become a Super Saiyan 2. A Super Saiyan 2? No, I'm joking. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I'd like you to fight me. Oh dang! I was... it won't go easy. I was right. Fine by me. You really do look just like me. Yeah, pretty amazing. <laughs> Dang, did I literally dodge that? That's insane. Ooh, snap. power to overwhelm Frieza than yours. I could tell you weren't serious. You're incredible, Goku. Hey, you're no slouch yourself. I can see how you defeated Frieza so easily. Oh, really? Oh, come on. Let me charge up real quick. There we go. Oh, come on. Oh, my gosh. Dang, this guy's fast. All right, let me charge up now. That should be good. Easy. Might have just changed history for no reason then. Changed history. I just realized how far back in the stream I was. That's happened to me before. <laughs> yeah, that's happened to me before too. Amazing. You're just as good as I'd heard. That's crazy. No. Better even. <laughs> okay. I'll tell you everything. 
But please, it's important that you make sure not to tell anyone else what I'm about to tell you. Gotcha. Don't worry, talk away. Your secrets are safe with me. It might be difficult to believe what I'm about to say, but... I'm from the future. I've come here from 20 years into the future. Dang, 20 years? Using a time machine. The, the future? 20 years from now? So he's not even born My yet. My name is Trunks. I'm Vegeta's son. <laughs> he's going to freak out. <laughs> Vegeta's son? <laughs> Actually, Who's your mom? <laughs> now that you mention it, you do kind of look like him. I'm going to be born two and a half years from now. Yep. But that's not why I came here. There's something much more important I need to tell you. So please listen. Huh? Oh, right. Three years from now. On May 12th, at around 10 a.m., two incredibly powerful figures will appear on an island five and a half miles southwest from South City. Who are they? Are they aliens? No. They're androids. Created right here on Earth. They were created by a mad scientist from the former Red Ribbon Army named Dr. Giro. The Red Ribbon Army? That's right. The same one you took down many years ago. Yep, in the Dragon oh, Ball yeah. series. When I was just a little guy. A little guy? I thought I got rid of those guys a while ago. Like back when I beat up their boss. Unfortunately, <laughs> Dr. Giro survived and continued his research. So what's he after? World domination or something else crazy? I'm not entirely sure, but it's possible that was his end goal. But his androids were designed to be killing machines. And they eventually turned on their creator. Yep. Meaning the androids were free to kill and destroy to AI. their heart's content. That is AI right there. It's been there. just me against the two of them. I struggled to make it out alive. Wait. Uh... What happened to everybody else? They're gone. 20 years from now, I'm the only fighter left. The Z fighters. In the fight, three years from now, my father over there, Krillin, Piccolo, everyone is killed. Only Gohan managed to make it out alive. He taught me how to fight four years before I came here in the time machine. As you know, with Piccolo gone, the Dragon Balls could no longer be used. True. Meaning we couldn't bring anyone back once they were killed. The androids' unquenchable <clears throat> lust for bloodshed eventually turned the world into a nightmarish hellscape. They're too strong. Nothing can take them down. Hey, wait, hold up a sec. What about me? They didn't kill me too, did they? Even you couldn't join in the fight. Not too long from now, you'll fall prey to a severe heart virus. What? A uh, piccolo. <laughs> yeah, now, look at him. She's muscle. Sensu beans won't work, huh? Man, this sucks on so many levels. I can't believe I'm gonna die in such a lame way. I really <laughs> wanted to fight those guys. <laughs> you, you're disappointed you can't fight them? Aren't you scared? Well, yeah, I'm scared. But you said they're crazy strong, right? Of course I want to fight them. <laughs> I see. You really are a true Saiyan warrior, aren't you? Here, when you start to see symptoms, take this. It's a mm. medicine developed 20 years from now. It should keep you alive. Whoa, really? Awesome, thanks. Why is he always Normally, everywhere? <laughs> history shouldn't be changed. But I've got to do whatever I can to prevent those atrocities from coming to pass. My mother always spoke very well of you. She knew you'd help us. Oh. That's what pushed her to complete the time machine. <laughs> Goku's gonna ask. Wait, your mother? She knows who I am? Yes, she knows you well. Wait, you said she built a time machine. Isn't that right? And the only person I know who can do that is... <laughs> no way! Your mom isn't... Yes. She's right over there. <laughs> oh, snap! Whoa! 
<laughs> Vegeta Bola? and Bulma. Out of all the stuff you just told me, that's got to be the craziest. I thought she'd stick with Yamcha. Oh, snap. To, to think she'd end up with Vegeta of all people. I mean, I mean they are staying on the opposite sides. No They're not together yet. Uh, uh, please, make sure not well, to actually, tell anyone. I, think, I can't have people knowing who I really am. I think Vegeta's if you do, well, living with I, Bulma uh, right now. Might never be born. Oh, yeah, right. Mum's the word. Well, I'd better get going back to my own time. I need to let my mother know how everything went here. Hey, are we going to see you again? Yes. Making a round trip in the time machine requires a lot of energy, so it'll take some time. If I can survive until then, I'll definitely come back to lend my support three years from now. Stay alive. What a great new goal. Now I'm going to start training extra hard for the next three years. Did you like that one roach? That doesn't stay down no matter how many times you whack it. Oh my gosh. That is so true. Nice. Let's see. It's 2 o'clock. Um, I'll complete the next section. And then maybe we do some Burnout Paradise. I'm thinking. It'll be short Dragon Ball Z today. Go, well, go, wait, hold on. Now I just got to figure out what to tell everybody about this stuff. <laughs> He's going to say, he can't say anything. Hey, hey, Goku, we just saw that guy take off. Where did he go? Oh, uh, uh him? Yeah, he, uh, I, I guess you could say he went back home. Went back <laughs> home? So just who is this guy? Piccolo's going to uh, step in. Piccolo's going to um, step in. He, uh, well, he's... Hey. Isn't there something more important you should be telling us? Oh, snap. Huh? If you can't find the words, then allow me to help you. What? You mean you heard? My sense of hearing is leagues above yep. any of yours. Yep. Relax, all right. I won't say anything that could possibly endanger him. We're not going in unprepared. If we die, it won't be for lack of skill. Wait. Die? Piccolo's a smart cockroach. What are you saying? <laughs> <laughs> on the hunt for the androids. And I Piccolo think... explain the situation, okay, being careful to avoid revealing anything that could expose Trunks' identity. The others could do little to hide their shock at what he had to say. About the terrifying truth regarding the two androids that would appear three years from now. In order to prevent history from plunging into darkness, everyone made the decision to train for the upcoming fight against the androids. Uh, androids, huh? Man, I never thought I'd hear anybody mention the Red Ribbon Army again. Was that young man really from the future? What? I'm just as shocked as all of you, but I actually think we can trust this guy. Kakarot. So look how mad he looks. How did you get off planet Namek alive? <laughs> right. We've been going crazy wondering what happened to you. Yeah. For a second or two, I thought I was done for. Yo, he, it looks then, like he's going to start right at swinging at second, Goku. I somehow managed to find a spaceship. That's right. The Ginyu forces. You took one of their ships. But when I jumped in and started to fly away, the spaceship took me to a planet called Yardrat. Those Ginyu goons had attacked Yardrat before, so they must have had that as the destination. So that explains the getup. I'm guessing that's what the Yardrats wear? <laughs> yep, they were all super friendly. They gave me these clothes since mine were torn up pretty bad. I find it extremely hard to believe that you came back from Yardrat empty-handed. Those freaks may be weak, but they have strange powers. Oh. You picked up some of them, right? Oh, he learned. <laughs> Bingo! Yep. I wanted to learn a lot more, but they really only had time to teach me one technique of theirs. It's called instant transmission. Huh? Instant, instant transmission? transmission? Yep, instant transmission. The weird thing is, is that you have to home in on the energy of a person, not a place. Oh. So you can't warp to a place unless you know someone there. <laughs> that's one heck of a downside, huh? Uh, that's, that's true. That's not much of a downside, if you ask me. 
Well, I guess there's nothing you can't do now, huh? <laughs> all right. <laughs> I guess we'll all see each other again three years from now. So, when and where should we meet? The androids will arrive May 12th at 10 a.m. on an island five and a half miles southwest of South City. We'll be meeting up on that same island an hour earlier at nine. And don't show up unless you're ready to fight. We're not going to babysit those unable to pull their own weight. Kakarot. <laughs> He's talking to Gohan. <laughs> you may be a super saiyan, but mark my words. I promise I'm going to put you in your place soon enough. Don't forget that the number one saiyan here will always be me. That's crazy. <laughs> so wait, Gohan's going to be like nine or right, ten, so I think. I guess we'll see each other in three years. Uh, where we said. Hey. Don't show up unless you really feel you're ready. All right. We better get going. So, Piccolo, what do you say? Want to train with me and Gohan? I've been dying to fight you again. <laughs> oh, snap. <laughs> sure. Sounds good to me. Yay! <laughs> I get to train with Mr. Piccolo again. All right. See you guys soon. Or in three years. Right. We're making a stop home first. Right, Dad? Mom's been waiting for you. Oh, snap. Oh, yeah, right. Guess I'd better get some FaceTime in with Chi-Chi, huh? Piccolo, is it okay with you if we do that? Fine, but don't waste too much of our time. 